up everybody, it's Random Guy here with another exciting episode of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. While I was uh, playing in my off time, I managed to accidentally kill an important person from the Order. Yeah, I wasn't even aware that he was actually in the area. I was actually trying to get some of the armor that I couldn't get last time. And I went to a market when I was finding some guards because I was, you know, killing every single guard in the area. I accidentally blew up a pot that exploded and he just so happened to have been near the vicinity of the explosion and died with the explosion. After I finished killing all the guards, I started looting all the bodies and I got the option to confirm kill. And lo and behold, he's dead. And also, shortly after I left last time, I found out exactly what I needed to do to advance the story. I just have to go over here and mention London. Or London, however they say it in the game. Word of our growing settlement has reached outside ears. So have a look around. You may see a few new faces. I want to see the Alliance map. Yeah, all I had to do was literally just come here. Hytham asked that I travel to London. What do you know of it? A wild city, one that Hafton Ragnarsson tried to claim for himself years ago. But it resists all attempts to be held. Hytham claims the city is overrun by a strange cult, the Order of the Ancients. He asks that I track them down and kill them. Doing so may help the honest people there, and earn us an ally in the process. In a city so chaotic, it is worth a try. Approach by the north gate and start asking around. I will. Good. I await your return. And that's all I had to do to start the next quest. Simple, wasn't it? There. Now we've officially made it. Triple Gate of London. Might find an official worth his salt here. I beg patience, all. We'll have this rack cleaned up in no time. Keep it steady, huh? Neonov. Hey, bear our master, Ami. You'll be on your way shortly, huh? Something of a shepherd, aren't you? <laughs> it can feel that way, aye. Can I help you with something? Who governs this burr? I would like to speak with him, if I can. Ah, the governor Trigger. Good and fair day and come to London four years back. Trigger? Aye, most hours of the day you can find him at the old villa. <laughs> Dealing with all manner of knavery. Stow! Oh, I don't like this. Avgos wants his cut of the summer harvest. Shit, Carl. <laughs> huh? What's the hold up? Your face. We're talking. Gentlemen, the farmers of Mercia have paid their burden already. If Avgos wants more, he can petition for it. Petition for it? Well, you can tell that old mud merchant. <laughs> And if he wants his apple, he can bob for it. Belongs to Master Ame, sir. Bob for it! That is filthy. Bob for it! Can I just kill him? 
finish fights as well as you start them. Was that a fight just now? It looked like you were trying to comb that man's beard. Road, be a good lad and prick the names of those that pay their food tax, will you? Right then. You've some dealings with Governor Trigger, was that it? I'll have dealings with any who can deliver a fair friendship with my Raven clan. If that's you, then all the better. Ah, no. Trigger's your fellow. I'm the Shire Reeve of London's westerly half. I keep things ordered and fair. Shire Reeve is not a name that rides easy on the tongue. Reeve's my title, sorry. Stowe's my name, Stowe of London. A burly name for a burly man. I like one who can hold himself in a brawl. To walk tall in London, a man must know how to swing his fists. It's not empty praise I give. <laughs> oh, the wink. Well, your candor is appreciated. Take me to your governor, Stowe. He sounds like a man worth knowing. Right then. Station field, flock shepherded, and off to Trigo we go. All right. Let's go. What can I call you? Humbler of thugs? Dane Hammer? I am Eivor, of the Raven Clan. We have a settlement to the north, just off the River Neen. Well, I owe you a great debt, Eivor. You're a worthy ally. Can you move? Thank you. So this is London, a city built by giants. So they say. She's an old place, surly as they come. But there's a mystery here I quite adore. I was raised here, in fact. Learned the scriptures of Christ's apostles in Lundinwich. I was Saxon Burra, just past the Western Walls. You're not a priest, are you? <laughs> no. No, no, I was raised by them. And for a penniless bastard, I turned out pretty well. A penniless bastard, and now London's fearless reeve. Well, it's Trigger who saw something in me. He judges not the circumstance of my birth. His two hands, left and right, are me and a Dane-born soldier, Erke. Erke is an orphan of the last Viking horde put down in Linden for a season. Two or three years back now, it must have been. It's through Trigger I met Erke, and now we Reeves walk the city like parents looking after our children. A native son and an imported Dane. See, London's a city built of many pieces. At the Wait. US. Something's wrong. Iron on the ear. This blood is fresh. These were good men. What's happened here? I don't know, Brawl probably pissed them off. That's just my guess. God, no. No, no, no. It took three arrows to kill him. The next twelve were an insult. Oh Lord, deliver these men with the light of thy countenance visiteth and shines upon them. You've no need for outsiders, Stowe. It's a private matter. There's no cause to be leery. Eivor had my back in a brawl at Cripplegate. More thugs from the garrison. Hmm. You must be a real broker to hold your own against those shit hugs. It's time to fatter those men, Stowe. It can't go on like... like this. You must be Erke. London's second reeve? Erke Botelson, yes I am. Are you telling me this gut bucket called me second reeve? First, in the Eastborough. And a man I trust with my life. Stowe's never been a good judge of character. Erke, this is Eivor. She came to meet with Trigger, to seal the bonds of friendship with the clan. He would have welcomed you heartily. He was a trusting man. And that got him here. Have you found anything? I just arrived. The killers left a ladder on the body there. I'll have a look around. The trigger had men with him at all times. How could the killers get through? I must have been known to him. Well enough to get close without suspicion. Good and holy Christ, that could be most anyone. He governed this burg. Oh dear. This letter. Someone wanted us to see it. 
From Rome went an order of heretics who worshipped the relics of a time before Christ. Erge, this was the letter he told us about. Said it contained fearful news about London. It warns of free such heathens who have infiltrated London. His killers, I expect. Oh dear. What is this? Whoa. Sorry. Mistresses. Intriguous desk. Ah, oh, yes. The old man had a wandering hand. And I. I didn't know. I didn't think. He didn't want you to. It was his secret to keep. A barber surgeon's tools. Sharp and precise for easy butchery. Must have been what was used to free Trigger's head from his neck. There's a lot of blood coming off here, too. Luba, my commander, my friend. I hope you are in high spirits in this warm weather. Uh, Luba never gets as cold as Norway. It rains here nearly every day. I feel as cold and gray as a fish. A common affliction here, I've found. Still, the walls hold strong and our larders stay fat with bounty. I do not miss going a Viking. I've seen enough golden sunrises for my days. Now I am ready to rest on my laurels and have my taste of the city's trollops. If you grow tired of sleeping on ships or of wearing Ivar around your neck like a noose, there is always a throne for you here. Your brother in arms, Triker. Three sets of footprints leave. Two average and one massive. I didn't even notice that part. I do not envy this man's death. Hang on, there's something in his hand. This was not Trigger's seal? No, it looks Roman in origin. It must have been on a ladder he opened. It must have been significant to this god for him to grasp it, even in death. Mayhaps it's what got him killed. I think I have a clear idea of what happened here. Yeah. Trigger was shot where he sat, probably as he read the letter. One of his guards grabbed the seal and tried to escape. He didn't make it. A second killer found him first. He met his end at the noose, lifted by the bigger man. A third attacker took his eyes, then came for Trigger's head. Symbolic, maybe. Headless leader, eyeless guards. The killers were without fear. This kill was a message. Their footprints leave together. Three sets heading back to the courtyard. The letter mentions three heretics, named only by monikers. The leech, the arrow, the compass. Signed by someone calling himself a poor fellow soldier of Christ. Poor fellow soldier. Odd name. Three names, three killers, as you said. Baltersack. It could be anyone in London. Who can we trust? Only the people in this room, I fear. Even that would be unwise, until we know more. The arrow is described as a pugnacious Dane invader. That describes too many in London. The leech hails from Vesex. London is home to many of them as well. And the compass, a Frankish captain. Less common, but no face comes to mind. What is this symbol here? I recognize that from the Mithraic temple. I passed it on the way here. Mithraic temple? Is that a church? A church? Heavens, no. Mithras was a pagan idea, a so-called god beloved by the ancient soldiers that built this city. Our city is overrun with cowards. We may be next to fall if we don't resolve this sick fermentation of hate. I've told you, this city answers to blood and power. We should serve as such. I mean, he's can't not leave wrong. him like this. He's... I need to. We'll get the church to see to it, though. No. No, it should be me. I must ready him for judgment. I understand. Only well, get some air from time to time. It reeks in here. Shall we, Broga? I didn't even know where where the place was. To arms! Defend Trigger! Ah, well, now the locals have caught a whiff of this fatted mess. The temple is yours to explore, Eivor. It's to the east of here. I must wear my Reeves face for a time. Keep away! Keep away! The fight is over. Town Hall will follow soon. Should the Reeves change their minds, I will have to gut them and put a puppet atop London's throne. But Stowe seems a good man. I will trust his word. 
Guess I'll just make my way over there then. Ooh, that's a lot of guards. Oh, no, no. There we go. The Temple of Mithras, well guarded for a tangle of old ruins. I need to find the entrance. Yes, well, then again, he is a um, quarter boss fight. <laughs> So it's only, it only makes sense that he would be that high. Love it. Time to die. Bye. Ah, killed with gravity. My friend's back. Bye. later. Thank you so much for not calling everybody over here. Got him. Got him. Approximately ten hours later. That was easy. Got him. Bring it. Ooh. Thanks for your patronage. Is that everybody? Ha ha! It worked. I just hope there's no guards down here because I am not ready for a full on fight again. I mean, you saw the way I cheese that one. Tools for a surgeon, finely crafted, like we found in the villa. And there is a letter here, arranging payment to a blacksmith. Uh oh. Ah, this one I do have to move, though. <laughs> Did I move this back? <laughs> yeah, maybe that served no purpose then. <laughs> Sometimes I really do hate to move into this game. The compass holds sway over the others. He has ordered the arrow to recruit archers in a market to the west. Worth a visit. Yeah, I might have to um, do some more offline play just to level up. At least to the point where I can, you know, the other side must be barred. Fight with ease and not have to rely on cheesy tactics. Although it is fun teasing opponents out like that, it's just not how I feel like playing the entire game. If anything, I'd rather be, you know matched with them. Just blended in with the fire 
going so well now. That it's hard to tell if it's sort or not. Messages between the leech and the compass. Healing, gutting. The leech is a strange one, but the compass calls the strikes. Let our wretched origins be known. We are the instruments of the ancient gods. We are the refuse of an. I've got enough to go on for now. Erke and Stowe must see all this. I see more bloodshed in London's future. At least soon, and we'll feast. We are the refuse of an ancient world, yet we are the hope of an era reborn. Let our great task be stated. We are the shepherds of our creator's will. We are the curators of our creator's tools. We are the new masters of the world they made. Let our loyalties be clear. The father of understanding guides us. The mother of wisdom inspires us. The sacred voice fills our hearts with boldness. Let it be known. We men and women of the order of the ancients are the natural arbiters of the world. Let all those who oppose us perish in pain. We are everywhere, and we are eternal. In the name of Mithras, the last warrior, go forth and dominate. Reclaim the world that is ours by will. Yeah, the Templar Order, basically. But before they became Templars. It's worth knocking on a few doors, that's all I'm saying. Trigger wasn't killed because you want to plant a few trees and fix a few roofs in London. Looks less like a meal for crows in here. Eivor, you bring good findings, I hope? Absolutely. A few sheets of vellum, notes between members of a secret society. The Order of the Ancients, they're called. Order of the Ancients? Doesn't sound any bells in this head. What's the purpose? That would take some time to explain. But know this, that I am here to kill them. In London, it seems the compass is the head. The arrow and the leech are his hands. Pet names and secret orders. What a crock. Do we know anything we can act on? The compass is a mystery. He's mentioned often, but there's little to go on. Said he was a Frankish captain, did you? To find him, we'd have to mark the ships that came and went along the Thames. Captains are a transient sort. And maybe he's far away, keeping quiet. That may be, but would he scream if we cut off his hands? Oh, you've a filthy mind for strategy. Of course. We kill the arrow and the leech, then sit back and wait. Let the compass come to us. The leech has need of flesh. Been looking for thralls, though I can't say why. We found a number of dead down by the keys lately, but not thralls alone. Some of the missing we find again, in several places, cut to pieces. Good lord, Erke. The arrow is a Dane who has seen his share of battle. His name suggests that he's an archer. I bet my knuckles he's the one sowing discord among the Danes that shelter in London. If it were me, I'd hide among my ranks, surrounded by other fighting men. The arrow has orders from the Compass to recruit soldiers at a market in the West. I know the very place. Let's not waste any more time. We will find the arrow and the leech. Killing both should drag the compass back into port. Stowe, I'll catch you at the Western Market. Count on it. And I'll make for the keys. There's another few bodies there to fish out of the muck. It could be the leech is back at work. God be with us, friends. Go in his name, and be protected by him. Oh boy, we got some murder mystery now. A pattern of the mystery. But this is a pretty good place to wrap things up for this episode. Unless I want to go even longer. If you guys don't mind me going longer, just let me know down in the comments. I don't know exactly how far back it's gonna be before I can get to them. I will most certainly be keeping track of them for now. So like I said, just let me know down in the comments. And I will see you all in the next video. Later.